Hello and welcome techies. This is Sambhav here. So in today's session we are going to discuss the solutions of the first part uh, which we have seen earlier of Prokshot. I hope you remember that there were some assignment questions and today is the day when we are going to discuss that. So if you have not seen my previous video, I would request you to go and see Prokshot part 1. And I will also request you to subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you get the latest update as soon as I upload a new video. So let's get started. So we have discussed lots of things in the last session and after that oh, we have done this hands-on exercise and after that I have given you this five questions as an assignment. So in this session I am going to give solutions to all these five questions and if you have done it please check your answers right so let's get started so I have just taken down all those five questions here in my SAS editor and will solve them one by one so the first question is sort the sasl dot shoes data set in the uh, sorry this is uh, class data set I'm sorry sasl dot class data set in the descending order of their weight now let's look at our sasl dot class data set so let me print it okay proc print data is equal to sasl dot class run so let's have a look at the data set so this is my data set which has got five variables name sex age height and weight so the question is to sort the data set in the descending order of the weight it means that I want the highest weight on the top and the lightest weight at the bottom so let's do it it's pretty simple proc sort data is equal to sasl dot class out is equal to let's say I'll give the data set name as sort underscore one by descending descending order of weight and let's print the sorted data so I will write rock print data is equal to sort underscore one run. now let's execute this piece of code to get the result so as you can see our data is sorted in the descending order of weight so the heaviest weight is 150 which is on the top and the lightest weight 50.5 is at the bottom let's go to the next question uh, sort sasl dot cars data set in the ascending order of the cylinder so let's print the data set first and see how it is raw print data is equal to sasl dot cars run so this will print my data set and let's have a look at it okay typo P R I N T proc print and let's execute it. So this is how my data set is. This is what my data set is. So you can see there are so many variables like make, model, type, origin, drive, train, MSR. So uh, your question is to sort the data set based on cylinders. It means the vehicles with lowest cylinder on the top and higher cylinder at the bottom basically an ascending order so what we will do is we'll write prop sort data is equal to sasl dot cars out is equal to let's say sort underscore two by cylinder cylinder run. and let me print the uh, result prop print data is equal to sort underscore two run. so if I execute this code we'll be getting this result okay it shows that there is some error let's fix this first so it says variable cylinder not found what is wrong let's look at the result Oh, uh, the variable name is cylinders. So guys, you must be 
careful about the variable name exactly so it is cylinders so let me re-execute the code and get it done for you so you can also check your code you see if you have done the same thing now you see in the cylinders we have uh, dot dot three four five uh, sorry five six and you can see the data is sorted in the ascending order of cylinder but you must be wondering why do we have these two dots in the first two positions right in the first two observation for cylinders it shows dot it means it is a missing value and always remember the missing value will be considered to be as the smallest value in the entire row missing value will be considered to be as the smallest value so whenever you sort any data based on a particular variable which contains missing value so those missing values will always appear at the top right now let's go and solve the third question highways so this was the result i'm just going to check whether it is highways it is highway guys right mpg underscore mileage per gallon on the highway so let me solve this problem proc sort data is equal to sas help dot cars and out is equal to sort underscore three by uh, it is in the ascending order so mileage per gallon on highway not highways run prop print data is equal to sort underscore three run so this will give me the solution so let's have a look at it so we will have the least mileage on the top and maximum mileage at the bottom so you see 12 uh, so and then followed by 19 20 so this is the mileage we have right these many miles per gallon so 12 miles per gallon 13 14 15 16 so this is basically we are talking about all right then the next question is sasal dot cars in the descending order of the weight descending on order of the weight of the cars so highest weight on the top and the lowest weight at the bottom heaviest cars on the top and the lightest cars on the bottom so let's solve this problem proc sort data is equal to sas help dot cars out is equal to uh, let's say sort underscore four by weight run raw print data is equal to sort underscore four run now it is in descending order of the weight so we will have to add a keyword descending descending because you must remember whether you have to sort the data in the ascending order or descending order so this is descending so i am adding a word keyword descending which must be added before the variable now let's execute it to see the result okay again something has gone wrong typo same typing error print now if i execute this it should work fine So wait, wait, yes, you see, this is the heaviest vehicle, that is 7,190 and slowly, gradually as you descend down, it will be, the weights will be reducing lighter and lighter. That is what descending does, correct? Now let's go to and solve the last question. Uh, organize sasl.shoes data set in the descending order of return. So let's print the data set first. Raw print data is equal to sasl dot choose run and let executes the, let's execute this code just to see how the data set is now if you look at this this has got variables such as region product subsidiary store sales inventory and returns so we have to sort the data set based on return so our by variable is returns and that in the descending order that means highest returns on the top and lowest return at the bottom so proc sort data is equal to sasl dot choose 
and let me store it as sort underscore five by descending order of weight or sort returns returns run raw print data is equal to sassel oh, sorry sort I'm sorry sort five run so this will give me the result let's have a look at it so you see the returns the maximum return is fifty seven thousand three hundred and sixty two dollars and as you scroll down you will see the reducing value of the returns correct so we have sorted the data successfully so this is a solution for all the five questions which we have seen in the which I have given you in the last session well that's all for today guys thank you so much for your time you have a wonderful day ahead and please don't forget to subscribe the channel and also hit the bell icon thank you so much have a wonderful day ahead